Hello everyone, welcome to my channel or welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be showing you how to create a comic book dot effect in Abyss Paint. So here we have a quick drawing I did. As you can see there's some parts here with the shading on the hair. So what you're going to want to do is go to any layer. It doesn't matter if it has a setting on it or the opacity. Just go to any layer you want. Now you're going to want to go here. I have this one on multiply because it was for shading, but that doesn't change anything about the overall effect. So here in blending mode you have a bunch of different things that you can do that are all really nice, but they are not the dot ones. To get the dot effect you're going to want to go into screen tone. And as you can see there's many different effects. There's the square effect. And there's crosses. There's just a bunch of really neat stuff. And the comic book dots are at the top. There are different sized dots. And there's also horizontal lines and vertical lines. There's even a, a noise filter. Which is quite nice but doesn't work for this particular drawing. Once you've found the size that you want, then you can just exit out of that menu. And it's there. It's worth noting that with the dots, colour can't be saved on them, they will always be black. Thank you very much for watching the video, I hope that you found it helpful. If you did, maybe consider leaving a like or subscribing. Thank you for watching, bye!